Hello, everyone. Uh, thank you for everyone. Uh, thank you for the Mr. Chairman uh, for your introduc uh, introduction. I'm honored to have the chance to introduce uh, our terms some work in this special occasion. Uh, the topic of my uh, study here is unforgettable restaurant from online popularity of cognitive impairment research is a uh, very interesting uh, the online of my talk as follow uh, the first uh, uh, there are five parts in my speech uh, the background uh, the object and method uh, the result and uh, conclusion. Finally, there is a short expectation here. And uh, at first, uh, please uh, let me introduce me and our center. I am Jiang Ping from Shanghai Mental Health Center, uh, Shanghai uh, affiliated Shanghai Jiao Tong University School of Medicine, uh, which was founded in, in 1935 uh, with Mercy Hospital and the Shanghai Psychiatric Hospital being its predecessors. Mm. The center consists of Xu Hui campus and the Minhang campus. There are more than 1,100 full-time medical staff and uh, more than 2,100 open day beds. The, our center has strong technical force in clinical, uh, in clinic, including general psychiatry. Uh, clinical psychology, mood disorder, child and uh, adolescent psychiatry, and uh, addiction medicine. It is committed to developing and improving the clinical diagnosis and the treatment of mental disease, and is building a national psychiatric center. As to me, since 2016, I began involved in the work of uh, voluntary service on health education. Uh, now there is two main uh, directions in my research. One is uh, about innovate, uh, innovating form of uh, voluntary service. And the second is applying the innovated form of uh, voluntary service to intervention, intervent uh, health. And just based on this background, so uh, this special restaurant, unforgettable restaurant, came into our uh, region. Now, the first part is uh, the study's uh, background. Uh, online popularity of cognitive impairment. Yeah. Uh, uh, the unforgettable restaurant is ranging from a public welfare program very famous in China in the last uh, three years, uh, focusing on cognitive impairment, jointly produced and produced by several film and television companies uh, in 2019. There are many stars and elderly waiters with mild cognitive impairment. Uh, they run a restaurant that may serve the wrong dishes, uh, opening a warm 
uh, correlation between forgetting and watching. And the, it's he's very popular uh, as a online popularity more than twenty more than twenty one million internet hits were received uh, the first two days after it launching, and the cumulative number of the program will now has exceeded 1.4 billion online. Uh, so uh, this uh, uh, um, online popularity is background. And uh, later, uh, after this online popularity uh, is very famous, so a special restaurant born out of this program with the same name was opened uh, officially in the prime of Shanghai, China on uh, January 25th, 2020. The waiters also here are served by the elderly patients with cognitive impairment. So uh, this now the restaurant's goal is to change the society's inherent view on the issue of disability and dementia on China, in China and to remind the whole society of paying attention to a serious issues such as the reintegration of disabled and demented elderly people to reserve others and rebuilding their social evaluations. So this is uh, our study's background. And uh, when I uh, sought to do some research in this restaurant, our uh, objects and the method is uh, the study's object is the impact of their work in the restaurant on their social service communication performance in this elderly. Uh, so the method uh, uh, we use a questionnaire was optimized on literature regarding the senile cognitive uh, impairments, social services, and the social communication of the elderly. There are six parts in this quest, uh, questionnaire. Willingness to attend activities, attention in activities, expression ability to uh, expression ability, ability to communication with others, and the degree of participation, enjoyment of the process activities. And uh, uh, who used this questionnaire? In this study, the trained staff are both restaurant volunteers to provide on-site medical security for elderly waiters and the research observes to evaluate and score various. Uh, this, this is the study's object and the method. And uh, as to the results, uh, figure one uh, shows the results. Mm. That is in the sixth part in our questionnaire. There are four parts uh, improving the social service communication activities of the elderly waiters in working in the restaurant. So the four parts a significant increase um, compared with the baseline. Uh, uh, we can see uh, after nearly eight months working, uh, the uh, 
uh, four index in all the six index improved significant improved uh, the four parts is the participation uh, their mobility their expressiveness and the willingness to participate in this program yeah and uh, what we can conclude from the results uh, the first is uh, the unforgettable restaurant so why as an opportunity to encourage the disabled and uh, mentally retarded elderly to speak up for themselves and take the first step of uh, returning to society by serving others. Yeah, by serving others is very important for this study. And the second is uh, this restaurant has established our teams. Uh, our teams include uh, teams of experts on health project for the elderly, another team of college student volunteers, and an evaluation mechanism for the entry and exit for the elderly. Yeah. And the last part is our exp expectation in future on this uh, research. Uh, the first is uh, this uh, restaurant providing with job opportunities, continuing education opportunities, and even art exhibition opportunities to the disabled and demented groups return to the society are the most needed. Yeah. Uh, and the second is the uh, rest the work in the restaurant of the elderly waiters also belonging to the voluntary service of the elderly. It's very important the channel and the embodiment of the social participation of the elderly and an important way to realize active aging. And the last uh, uh, expectation, the last point is exploring new forms of voluntary services for the elderly, promoting the virtuous cycle of the elderly participation in voluntary services and the promotion, promoting the scientific formulation of policy related to the aging. So I think this is very important for this, um, uh, this restaurant or uh, this study. It's not only a scientific research, it's also a uh, very important uh, society topic. Yeah, so uh, promoting the scientific formula of policies about aging is more important, I think. So, so in the, uh, finally, please let me introduce uh, some of our work in the voluntary uh, service. So I and our team uh, spent many, uh, some years in this uh, field. So uh, after um, after we got uh, more than 16 programs, different programs, uh, we now we have uh, set up uh, some uh, innovative forms of voluntary service, not only for the Chinese voluntary volunteer, but also for some foreign volunteers. Uh, we can see this is some foreign volunteers in community voluntary service in China. Uh, they um, show they get some talk show uh, for the Chinese community resident. Yeah, and uh, we do some inter intervent 
uh, in these forms. Uh, and uh, we still have some work for the international uh, communication. So here is the visiting scholar program to the uh, US. Yeah. And uh, we still have some, now we still have some practice and uh, internship base for the international student to do some internship. Yeah, here. And uh, not only the work, but also get some research in voluntary supplies. Uh, here is our some papers, our books, and some award in the voluntary supplies. I think uh, the unforgettable restaurant is not only a, a online popularity, but also uh, we can do many things in this research. And all the uh, research result and the conclusion should um, improve the policy uh, about aging. Thank you very much.